What are you thinking? What do you want to get out of it? I see this watch all over the place for its price. You guys know I've been here a couple times. What's the best you could do? You know, I'm not trying to haggle with you guys even. <laughs> you do this deliberately. He does this. Did he tell you he was going to do this to me? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's the way he works. That's the way he rolls, as they say. Oh, I don't want to shoot anymore. <laughs> well, good thing I was shooting at the ground. So, hey guys, Pete over here. Got a package all the way from uh, UK, England, Great Britain, however you want to call it. I'm across the pond. Who sent this? You sure, you're shaking it up like that. Well, I mean, it went across the pond being shaken, <laughs> but Simon, what did you get me, Simon? Got a paper action. I used to pack stuff like that, that I would just, if it had a box, I would wrap it up in a paper, you know? Hmm. Hmm. Yorkshire tea. Well, thank you so much. I'm actually a tea drinker, so I will enjoy some good uh, English tea. Thank you very much. Let's get into today's video. Quit, uh, you quit playing? I haven't played in a while. What do you want to get out of it? You tell me, Peter. You Ten always... Bucks. You always do this to me. <laughs> <laughs> you I didn't just turn, You didn't just turn it on. Yes. Because you, 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 want, you want to have some fun with me? Yeah. Today? Let's, let's have some fun. Yeah. <laughs> no, like, look. Brand new one. 30 bucks. This, I mean, brand, this is a brand new one, too, and they don't have I to know. pay the shipping. How about 15? Store credit. You know Store credit. I'll give you, you know fifteen. I'm good. You know I'm good. <laughs> you do this deliberately. He does this. Did he tell you he was going to do this to me? Yeah, yeah. See, that's the way he works. That's the way he rolls, as they say. Fifteen dollars store credit. All store credit. How yeah. about ten five store credit? How much store credit you got I, from you me now? You know, the now? thing is, I just saw How something many tickets there you that got? I wanted. I, over a hundred bucks. <sighs> Hopefully, you know, you don't lose them in a fire or something, you know, because... I feel like throwing them out. Every time I come in here, I can't find everything, you know, that I'd like to get. You know, I wish I could find something. I really, you know, that's why I'm selling this. I don't really need anything. Oh. Peter, it's always a pleasure. Hold always. on, hold on. Let always me give you the pleasure. credit. No, I'm going to come back in. I want to do something. I want to do something with the other thing. But you can write that Oh, out you got there. more. No, no, no. I want to... I want to... Look at that, I want to get my credits. Oh, okay, okay, okay. You all set, sir? I need uh, one. You want a knife? Yeah. Okay. Okay, let me grab the keys. All right, so we got 55, 20, 50, and all. This is on me, okay? Okay, thank you. Appreciate you. Thank you very much. And no bag. Huh? Back. You want a bag? Yes. Yeah. You're welcome. Take care. I apologize. I made a mess. If you got a broom, I'll sweep it up. No worries. I'll get that. Still more stuff coming out, but that tells, <laughs> that tells me it still runs. <laughs> oh yeah. All right. Let's see. Yeah. Yes, she runs. Oh yeah. I apologize for making a mess. All right, it's all right. I'll clean it up. I will clean it up. All right, table saw in exchange, a hundred dollar bill. Thank you. Appreciate you. Take Have care. a good day. Okay. All right, so we're gonna use a five dollar credit towards this, okay? And give me ten bucks. Fifteen dollars then. It's 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 an incredible deal for you. I mean, like, can you go wrong? Did you give me ten dollars for the ten ten dollars off? I gave you ten cash already. Yeah. You still yeah, got yeah, five dollar yeah. credit, which we're gonna apply towards this. Okay. I'm asking twenty five, so ten throw bucks. me ten bucks. I think it's a great deal. In store credit, I got all the credits. However you want to do it. Okay. I don't care. Okay, look at this, man. I mean, look at this. You wanted you. you... 
I gotta use Find this. one that you have $10 on. Okay, find one. No, no. Yeah, yeah, because five, I still haven't wrote you up here. You got five coming, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay, so, so find $10 there somewhere. There's another five. There's you can five. use that. Yeah, there's five. There's five. Okay, so we're looking for five more. You know, more. I'm printing these up on my own. I'm making these up at home, ah, you know? Looks like it. Yeah. This one is from December. Look at how long that one's from. I've wow. For years. This one is expired already. Oh, you said they never expire. What do you mean never? I can't hold stuff for 11 years. <laughs> <laughs> I want to find a bike or something. I can use all these. All okay, right. that's good. My son will like this. We went. We were actually at the game when Lester pitched. For the oh, World really? Series. Oh, yeah, yeah. He's, okay, nice. He'll like this. So well, this then is perfect. one thing I yeah. found something. I appreciate it. And thank you very much, you know. Well, I mean, use it in good health, you know. <laughs> Give it to your best customer. <laughs> Thanks, Richard. Yeah, always right. a pleasure, Peter. It's it's fun coming in here, you know. I got some new versions of GPS for you. One is from St. Clair and one is from Standard. Which one would you prefer? <laughs> <laughs> I, I like the look of Standard the is pretty artwork cool. on that yeah. one. Although this one, when you open it, it does have the original logo. See this little guy? Yeah, the Saint, Saint Clair, yeah. yeah. So, and uh, somebody's got a. Pete, what do you call this new technology? I've never seen this before. <laughs> Man, it's amazing how quickly you forget, right? How we used to move around. I mean, it's yeah. I mean, it's crazy. If you to go think from now it. to going back to something like this, it'd be kind of nerve-wracking a little bit. But it's it's not that long ago when you think about it. I know. I remember I mean, growing up. My when is the easy. first, the bulky GPSs, the first one that came out, they had the bulky back, like I it looked like my, a mini TV. Yeah, like the TomTom. -tom. Yeah, no, TomTom, -tom, yeah, like TomTom -tom too, but Garmin had the big, I mean, literally looked like an old miniature Sony TV, like, you know, those heavy, yeah. heavy ones. Yeah. I don't know, I bought my first GPS in... Early 2000s? 2009, yeah. maybe. 2008. So... But by that time, I was already pretty thin. Now, on this side, look, there's a whole map of the United States, right? That's my, my kid's vacation, was looking at maps like that. Yeah, and then this side just shows the Wisconsin. And you truly, really relied on this. You pull over at the rest area. Oh, this is going to be our next stop. You know, this is where we're going. This was, this is how we did it. This one is cool too. No date on this. I don't know how old they are, but. You ever run across the tool, the, 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 the sextant punch like that? Do you ever get those ones? Hmm. If you do, I'm, I'm looking at it. It's a nice punch because it's skinnier. It's See? a it's all steel punch. They're made by Thexton. They don't make hmm. them anymore. But I don't think so. Okay, if you run into something like that, I'd love to. Yeah. Yeah, I'll have to. Uh, How big is it? I mean, it looks. Uh, yeah, like, looks like, like that. that maybe big. like that. It's nice because it's skinnier. You what know? do you use it for? I'm in the upholstery business. We get oh, into places, okay, lining so panels up and things like that. And I had one I lost. Well, Occasionally, you might find punches like in our screwdriver bin, like in the yeah, blue But that one's special because it's real skinny. Give me your name and your number. If something like that pops up. Yeah, it's I'll called it's a Thexton. It's a, it's a, it's Thexton is the brand, the only one that made it. Any other tools you're looking for? For Well, that one right now in particular, it's called a 313 Super Punch. It's, it's handy because it's skinny. Okay. And it's strong. And you know, I've got punches with a big wide handle on them, but there's not, a lot of times we need that skinny handle to get into a place mm -hmm, and get mm -hmm. where we can't get a wide thing. And so yeah. that's what it's called, a Thexton. And, uh, Thexton, okay, Thexton I'll try to there. remember that. Hmm. Or a trim shop, poultry shop out in Lakemore. What are you guys doing? I'm skinny, I'm Cars, strong. Cars, boats, RVs. Well, I'm definitely keeping a number then. We do all the trim for the Volvo Auto Museum. We do the work for Camp Camping World. I do Brilliant's Honda. I do a lot of commercial cars, plus okay. plus walk-ins too. Okay. But yeah, I've been looking for. Would you those. Would you do any also seats for like a motorcycle and stuff? Sure. Yeah. Okay. Or my me or my son-in-law works out of the same shop. I mean, he used to work with me. Okay. And because we're getting more business up in Kenosha and Antioch, I said, why don't you start a separate business? And you and uh, you can handle that. So between the two of them, and then my son works for me full time. My, my son works for me. My so son your shop Bob, is somewhere around here, Lakemore. Um, okay, okay. You know, by uh, yeah, about ten minutes from down, ten minutes uh, from downtown McHenry. 
okay. we're over by uh, 120 and 12 over that way. By the Volo Auto Museum, you're about yeah, to, yeah, yeah, right yeah. there. I'm three minutes from that. But uh, Lily, I take like 176 to Lily, and mm -hmm. you can go up to 120, and it's right yeah, there. You yeah, go, yeah, where yeah. you go now? You go through town. Yeah. They they call it Lake Moore, but from my complex, you could probably throw a rock and hit Volo because it's right there. Oh yeah, it, yeah. Okay. Lake Moore got a little finger that stretches down 120. They say oh, we own that now. So that's why it's a lake more. Uh, and, uh, no, awesome. Yeah, I mean, I, sometimes I get different things that's here. That's what I'm that saying. I, you see that. that I'll definitely, definitely uh, keep your number, not even for this tool, but yeah. in the future for yeah. anything I'll But get. I, you know, I, those are, I like those punches. They're yeah. great because it's all steel all the way through. Yeah. And it's it's just, it's you can really maneuver, maneuver with it. Yeah. yeah. And so we left one a couple of years ago and probably had a seat of a car or something and never got it back. And I said, man, I missed that punch. So cool. if you run across, because I know sometimes you get people come in and hold the thing of tools. And yeah, you never know. That, so. But yeah. uh, I'd definitely be interested. Thanks. Sounds good. Bobby was always so controversial. Oh, yeah. yeah. Very polarizing individual. Slapping those kids around a little oh. bit. <laughs> <laughs> But, but, you know, funny, for so many years, I, I guess he got away with it because tickets are selling, the team is as winning, right? you're winning. Um, he was one of those guys. Yeah. Who's the certificate from for his it's autograph? On the back. Who knows who that is? Although this one is really nice. Nicely framed. Yeah. Nice plaque. It's got that little... There's plaque over here, too. I'm a little bit more confident with this celebrity <laughs> yeah, than appearance this. than actually that one. Uh, if I got to hold on to that, that's fine. I mean, I've been be an honest. Indiana fan my whole this life. This is local, right? Local team. Yeah. Lots of Chicago fans. This will sell tomorrow. This, well, I'm maybe not you. tomorrow, but a but yeah. lot quicker than, than Absolutely. Bobby will, you know? And some people love him, some people hate him. So that's one of those things. So I actually got to pass on this. Yeah, no worries. Okay. I'm an Indiana fan. I don't mind holding on. I'm just getting ready to move. What do you so want to get out of this one? <clears throat> um, you'll probably sell it for a $1,000. Um, if I could get, say, $750. I'm gonna be hundred percent honest with you. Um, right now, anything that it's like higher ticket items is not moving. Okay. People just are tied with the money. So eventually, yeah, maybe I could get kind of money, money like that. I, I sold his jerseys. I sold a bowl. Yeah. You know, I sold different things that he signed um, over the years. This is not even his picture, like real picture. It's just one of those legend, you know, things mm -hmm. that it's signed on it. I wouldn't offer you more than like 300 bucks for this. I wouldn't. I think at today's market, I maybe get five to six out of it. So it's totally a call on it. I can't part with it for three. Yeah. yeah. Sorry, my friend. No, it's it, all right. I understand. It's, Cool photo, cool frame, yeah. but it's just at, at at the moment the market is a little bit soft on stuff like this. So I understand. Um, it's tough, tough economy. Throw it on Facebook Marketplace. Maybe you'll get closer to your number because okay. I, I like you when you throw it out seven seven fifty. Maybe you get that. Maybe. I had so for me offer, to pay it, I had an offer of six fifty on it already. So I'm. And this was five years ago in a better market. So I'll yeah. hold on to it and see what I can do with it. Yeah, there. I'm sorry. No, no, I, please, I, I just, no apologies right necessary. Right now, I can't. I can't go any higher. I know? get it. And as much as I like his stuff, because iconic, you know, Walter Payton is just one of those players that you know. Yeah. But I'm I sorry, my friend. No worries. Okay. Cool, Glad cool. you guys could at least took time to look at yeah, it for me. Absolutely. Appreciate it. Yeah. I grab the door for it. Oh, that'd be great. So this is, I think, the one I was talking about. Very similar name. I don't know if they're at all affiliated. <sighs> I'm in celebrity authentics, and there's like terrible reputation. Yeah. And there's like lots of lots of bad things to say about them. Yeah. Because I think I remember you or Nick or somebody telling me about it, and. Yeah, I think it's them. It was it was like a company who like 
in-house did their own signing or something and then they authenticated yeah. it and you know said it's real and... yeah this 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 oh my gosh <laughs> she's always got something to say morse code this is a little tiny wrist even though he has the extra thing who is gonna where this? How does this come apart? I mean, I don't have big wrists, and I don't think this will fit me. Hmm. Ryan, try this the way it is. Can you put it on your wrist? Probably. Because we got only wrist. one link for it. You can tell I don't put that much as much. I mean, so far it seems like, yeah. Fits you? Okay. So, maybe. I mean, okay. you look like you're like a link away. But, you know, I do have an extra one, so it does help a little bit, but... You don't have the original box or papers or anything, right? Um, not that I'm aware. I can go down the second home, but I... It's just that one, one extra link, right? Yeah. What are you thinking? What do you want to get out of it? I see this watch all over the place for its price. Right, there's... <laughs> so it's all, all about the condition and then, you know, if it's, if it's black or if it's silver, if it's blue. All the way from $100... Oh... That's the bottom, and the highest one I'm seeing is like 575, you know, for used. 525, 390, 330, 250, 310, and 150. You guys know I've been here a couple of times. What's the best you could do? You know, I'm not trying to haggle with you guys even. I mean, overall, it is clean. The glass is not scratched up. Uh, I wish you had a couple more extra links. Buck 50. I think on average is about $300, so I'm going to be kind of halfway there. That works. That works for you? Yeah. Like okay. I said, you guys have helped me out before and stuff. All right. Let me have your ID. I'll write you up. Like I said, if I do find stuff at home, I'm bringing it to you guys, you know? I had the box somewhere. I just, uh, I think I was telling you guys last time about my storage. Somebody broke into my storage unit and I lost all my stuff. Right now I'm dealing with the Algonquin police and really? trying to get it back. Yeah, as much as I can, but... It had everything How I had would they there. broke? I mean, it had to been somebody. It, somebody had to be in a building, had access to the building, some, right? They rented um uh, a woman rented out a unit in the building to get the code for the building, and then they went and found my unit, broke into my unit, and took all my shit. But it's just your unit, no other unit. They were looking wow. around for my unit, so wow, well. the house I was looking at before, they were sending my old statements to. So I don't know what it could be exactly, but. It could be a bunch of, bunch of things, but hopefully like Gonquin PD does something. Well, somebody didn't like you, I guess, you know? Why would they just go after your stuff, you know? Usually they try to get into a few different Because there was forty, fifty thousand dollars $50,000 worth of stuff in there. Really? <laughs> yeah. Well, I'm sorry to hear that, man, then. Like I said, hopefully they can recover some of it. Did they clean out, like, everything? Pretty much. Wow. Left a couple things, nothing really of any value. All the cool shit I had is gone. <laughs> Luckily, I had most of like the more important shit at home, but there was still some real cool shit there. All my personal Jordans and clothes and everything like that. All right, if I can give you an autograph on the bottom. You guys really don't got subs, do you? Like, Not at the moment, like car subs? Now. People are buying them, huh? <laughs> What's that? Yeah, you guys used to have a lot of them, and I, and I didn't see one. I almost bought a set yesterday, but we couldn't agree on the price with the guy. Uh, <laughs> this time of year, you know, everybody's trying to get their cards tricked out. And... All right, 50. All Thank right, you guys. Thanks, guys. Take care. I don't know what the game is all about. Nothing works. I hit start, nothing on. I think on? I just pressed actually that. Okay. You're probably more advanced, not beginner, so. No, you need to be a beginner. Start. Or what do you do? What am I doing? I can actually shoot, okay? So this is, we just, Ryan just bought this. Oh, there's a guy. How, how do I, ah! Oh! Oh, he got me twice. I don't know how to turn around to shoot him. <laughs> <laughs> My gosh, what's going on here? So this is Die Hard. Oh, I, he just killed me. Or am I still walking? No, I think no, I'm still walking. I think you're dying hard. <laughs> I don't have any bullets. All I can do is punch now. Oh, I got him. You're doing better with fists than the gun now. Yeah. So I can't believe this game is actually way up there, right? Like, it can go for a pretty penny. Yeah, I want to say like 140, maybe tops 200 bucks. 
we put it on auction. Do you guys want it? It's got somebody's initial on it, SJ. Do you guys, I can't hear you. <laughs> you told me yeah, that doesn't work that way. Yeah. Die Hard, NES, on auction, starting $1. If you're watching this video, when it just came out, three day auction, somebody's gonna be a lucky winner. A little sanitizer magic over here. This is very liquid sanitizer, like almost say, like Smirnoff. We'll get it all nice and clean for you guys. Look at that. Those initials are almost gone. How about that? Like it never happened. Look at that. Love it. Hey guys, it's Otto here. Can I get a thumbs up for the YouTube algorithm? It will really, really help us out. They're oldies, huh? Yeah, they're really old. Well, it has one. Still holds air. Oh. Still holds air. This is a Crossman. That one is done. That one has no compression whatsoever. That one is good. <laughs> and there's the BB. There's a BB. There's more inside of it. Oh, I don't want to shoot anymore. Lucky to shoot at least. Well, good thing I was shooting at the <laughs> ground. <laughs> so it bounced off somewhere. So that I'm going to be honest. That one is okay. going to be a no-no. Yeah. Okay. What do you want to get out of both of these? I mean, they've seen a better day, but yeah. they're still functional. What do you think? Commander in chief. You sold me a lot of guns, I remember. Yeah, yeah. I don't use them anymore. So I go in and go out. I don't know how much do you think? Uh, 30 bucks for both of them, like $15 a piece. Piece? Yeah, that's all I can do. We'll try to clean them up a little bit, but. If they were daisies, they would be a little bit more money. Daisy yeah, yeah. is a little bit more desirable when it comes to vintage, you know, but... So, you tell me what you want to do. You, you can do 40, right? I can. No? I, I can. Not on these. Okay. So you said that the coffee maker, you won't... The small appliances, if it's still new, yeah, I can move them, but the used ones, I just don't do good with them. So I'm going to say no on a coffee maker. What do you want to do? You can do 35, right, either? I don't no. want to. <laughs> okay, I'll do 30 then. That's 30 fine. bucks is yeah. kind of tops, okay? All right, I do need your ID so I can write you up. Here's 30 for you, okay? Right. Thank you, man. Yeah, thank you. Appreciate it. Yeah. You want the copy? Yeah. All right, so What's I got... up? I just bought this. Yeah, so I looked up the number that's on the back of it, which is this long number with the dots in between. Right. And I see a bunch available. Um, I don't see any of them sold. But then on some of those listings, I also saw this other number. And when I search those, I'm finding some that look the same, but the dotted number is different. But the used ones under that number are sold for like 200 bucks. Okay. Well, don't, um, don't use that number. Use the number above. But none of those are sold, but there's also like new ones as low as like 350 or so. I mean, so. this is a serious 800 chronograph. Right, that's what oh, all yeah. these are coming up as. Um, so I didn't know if this is, like I don't know what this other number is, but they look literally, they look identical. Hmm. But when you look through the loop, right, this number that it's on top is on a rim. Right. On a side here. Right. So I would just stick with that number, whatever comes up with that number. And ignore the other ones. I think so. Okay. I think so. Overall, it's in good condition. You do need to clean it up a little bit if right. you can. Okay. So, because I was hoping, I told them on average they were going for like three, and I was hoping that's what I'm gonna get out of it. You know, because there's, there's none with this actual model that sold. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, I didn't see it. different colors. I seen, like right. a silver. I seen with that, with that model number. Okay. So. Okay. Just stick with three hundred bucks on it. You know. Okay. Every episode now. Huh? Every episode, <laughs> Ninks brings me good news. What happened to the tail? Man, broke, oh man. This is nicely done. So this was probably about, what, 
30 inch Chinook female, not a male. Is it? Or is it a... No, it's not a Chinook because the colors are not right. This is Lake Trout. Yep. This is Lake Trout. <sighs> Nobody's going to buy it okay. without that tail. I took it off to Dave to see if Dave would fix it. Yeah, and? No. He doesn't do it anymore. He doesn't do it anymore. He doesn't do a lot of things anymore. I don't think he wants to do things anymore. No, I think he wants to retire and yeah. sell out. <laughs> It, this is nicely done. I mean, overall, this is beautifully done, but, wow. Well, Let's see if I get somebody to fix that tail. That would be nice. If, if you get it fixed, I'm definitely a buyer for it. You know, I would be interested, but the way it sits, okay. it's, it's, it's a hard one. All right. Sorry, my friend. All right. Can I sleep right here? Yeah, you can. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Walk around. Yeah, walk around. Honey, what are you doing? Why are you sitting on my money? <laughs> Come on, girl. Come on. I know I can get you out. And there you go. Good, good. What's up, guys? Hey, Some CDs? These, yeah. Sure. One, two, three, four, five, six, twelve bucks. There you go. Appreciate it. Thank you. Enjoy it. Hey, you gonna help? You gonna help? All right, guys, postcard time. 701, 702, 703, 704, 705, 706, 707, 708, 709, and 710. Guys, thank you. Thank you so much for watching. I appreciate you, and I'll catch you on the next one. Cheers.